My name is Liliane Magdi. I'm, uh, I'm an Egyptian uh, citizen journalist. Um, this is my first time uh, taking part in the uh, Arab Bloggers Conference. Um, I think it's very significant this year since it takes place um, amidst um, all the hype that is going on in the, re in the region with revolutions in six countries and um, two that have resulted in the ouster of the country's dictator uh, rulers. Um, I think that people uh, this year, uh, they are more focused on developing their tools to, to challenge, uh, the, to, 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 you know, their, it's their tools against the government's tools, against the regime's tools. Um, we, so far, um, none of, of, um, of the Arab revolutions have succeeded in completely eradicating the former regimes. So um, what these guys want to do is to um, discuss ways um, either to protect themselves while, um, while they're reporting and gathering data, uh, either to uh, expand their tools uh, when they are uh, in the streets. Uh, so they, they keep challenging uh, the, the, the regime's tools. Hearing people talk about, uh, like today, uh, early in the morning, our first session was uh, sort of an exchange uh, session. Um, there were people talking from Egypt, Bahrain, and Tunisia about the revolutions in these countries. And it was really inspiring to me to hear people. I mean, I, I know these guys on Twitter, but to hear them and see them in person talk about um, what they've gone through, what they have seen people go through. Who, uh, in in their revolutions, it's, it's absolutely inspirational. It, it it reminds me why why we why we we should keep on going doing what we do.